What is going on, Reed Nation? It's your boy Isaac Reed, and from my last video, I did this video in my bathroom because it's got more lighting and it looks greater, it looks ready and crisp. Now, I got this question, and when I saw this, I was like, okay, I, I can actually help. So the question asks me, uh, I want a girlfriend, how do I get one, basically? That's what basically it says, like, I think the question said, uh, I want a girlfriend, Isaac Reed, but I don't know how to get one, please help me. Okay, so this is this is what I'm gonna help you with. Now, finding girls is 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 not difficult, but the problem is trying to talk to them, trying to get their attention. It's not as easy as people think. Now, it might be easy some ways, but it might be some not. Now, I don't know where a girl at. If, if you want a girl, so basically, you go to school. You know, you go home, you chill. Um, look look at the people in your classes. You know, you might have some people in your classes that you know that you necessarily don't look at a certain way, but start paying attention to some girls in classes. If you really want a girl, you know, start talking to girls in your class, man. Starting to get to know girls, cause ain't nothing better than trying to get to know a girl. And before you even try to rush into things, I would probably try to get to know a girl for about a month or two, because the reason I say this, and I tell this to everybody, if you go straight away into a relationship, what can happen is you might figure out something that you didn't know about that certain person and then all of a sudden you can't get out of the relationship because you're stuck with them because they didn't fell in your spell or you didn't fell in their spell and it's like for example you talk to this girl for about a week or two you like I'm digging her you finally ask her out on the third week she says yes y'all love you and dove you for about four four weeks she finally tells you um I, I smoke weed every day and you're drug free Let's say if you're drug free, you're going to be sitting there like, dang, I really like this girl, but I don't like her doing this stuff. And you're going to be sitting there like, I'm so stuck because if I break up with her, I'm going to look like a bitch. And you're going to be stuck in a rock and a hard place. In my point of view, just get to know her for a very long time. And then when you truly know that she's the one, that she's right, go for it. You know, there's nothing better than getting to know somebody because the girl, I, the girl I've been with, I've been for three years straight. And before I even got to ask her out, man, I waited about a month to get to know her. And after that month was done, I went straight into it because I knew that she was going to be the one and I'm still with her. You know, it's, it's just a great, it's a great, it's a great journey. Now, when you look for a girl, Make sure it's the girl that you want. Not don't don't try to look for a random girl because that's just be thirsty. That's just thirsty. Usually when you look for a girl, you know, it's usually you don't look for one, they come to you. And sometimes it's that way, sometimes it's not. When I was I technically when I was um in ninth grade, I wasn't looking for anybody because I was already in a terrible relationship. I was in a horrible relationship. And I just wanted to chill and the girl that I was talking the girl I'm with now, she actually came to me. You know, it was crazy, you know, how we how we became together. It's just an awesome, amazing journey that everybody can go through one day. Now wanting a girl, you know, is same it's like you want a girl, but sometimes you can't always get one. Now for this person, I don't know who the person was. Some of these are anonymous, that's weird. Just be patient, you know, just be patient. If you want, don't don't go straight away trying to get a girl because it might not be the journey of a relationship that you want. Just be patient, just stay back, relax. You know, let the girls come to you. Sometimes they can come to you or you can come to them. Now, if you see this really cute girl in your class and you want her really bad, if she doesn't have a boyfriend, don't have a bad record, and she's Gucci, go for it, man. Just talk to her, you know, get to know her and, you know, but if you feel that connection right away and you want to go straight for it, I'm not going to be mad that you go straight for it because I understand some people are kind of, some people's hormones are a lot different than others. You know, some hormones are people that can be like, oh, I can chill. I don't have to have a girl for about a year or two. You know, I'm good. You know, some people just need a girl right away to bone or whatever they want to do. I'm not saying that's, I'm not going to agree with it, but that's how some people are. Now, if you're one of those guys that just want to go straight for a girl, you know, just be cautious. Like I said, you know, if you don't get to know her, man, and shit backfires, man, that's on you. Now, uh, with my relationship, I've been through a hell of a lot with my girl, but there's nothing like trying to work things out, you know. Just work things out. Just be cautious. Be humbled, and everything will work. Okay. So you want a girl? Like I said, just do you. Just do your thing. Be yourself. When you meet a girl, just be yourself. If you don't be yourself, man, eventually she's gonna figure out you're a fake and it's not gonna work out. Like, 
I've tried, I, you know, in middle school, I always tried to fit in, well, actually elementary school. Like in elementary school, like I was that one kid that tried to fit in and I was like, dang, this is not gonna work. So I started being myself. I started being that guy that jokes around and have fun. And that's actually how I am now. Like in school, I'm just the type of guy that jokes around. And eventually just people were just gonna like start liking you for you. So if you meet that girl, you know, just like her for you, just let her like you for you and not for somebody else that you're not. Like usually how I meet people is just by making them laugh. Like the girl I went down, when I first started talking to her, one thing I did was make her laugh. Like if she was cool. And just, you know, you if you want a girl, man, if you want a girl really bad, you know, look for one. If you see if you got it in your class, if you don't got it in your class, walk bus, walk, go to lunch and look for somebody. I'm not saying being thirsty as hell, because it, it kind of sounds thirsty, but don't necessarily do it that way. Just be be patient. I think be patient. Be patient is the best one. Just be patient, because if you're not patient, man, there's no reason to look for somebody. You you might as well just. I don't know. Just be patient, because if you're not patient, it's just not gonna work out for you. But if you're one of them patient guys, man, just go for it. And just like, you know, be patient and look for somebody because there's going to be that one person that's going to stand out above everybody else and you're going to love that person. So, you know, just go for it. Hope this advice helps you, whoever it was. I don't know who it was, but I thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe as well. And I'll see you guys in the next Q&A or ask as I read or whatever you want to call it. And I'll just peace out, Read Nation. Deuces, one love. I'm out. <laughs>